<clears throat> Morning, everyone. Thanks for joining us uh, for our sales webinar, introducing one of our latest integrations, EmployRight. We've got Katrina Birchall here with us today. She's the she's a director at EmployRight, but she's also the GM for sales and marketing, and she's going to tell us a little bit about the product, some about the history in the business, and um, some of the features and the benefits. We've got Melissa George with us, and she is our client relationship manager at SnapHire, and I'm sure lots of you are all very familiar with, with Mel. And then we've got Daniela with us as well, who is a client success consultant and is in our projects and implementations team. Daniela's role with, um, with this product as we've rolled it out. So actually, I'm Lisa Collins. I'm the head of partnerships for Talent App Store. Should have covered that one off. Um, we, when we bring a new app into our marketplace, we do technical testing and then we do like a user acceptance type testing and Daniela's fulfilled that role um, on behalf of all the SnapHire customers for this one. So she has put together a lot of the user guides and um, has uh, of the how to get started stuff. That's all Daniela's work. So she's going to demo the product for us in situ today. So thank you for that, Daniela. Um, I'm going to hand over to Katrina now and she's going to give you a bit of an introduction to Employer Right and tell you a little bit about the product. Good morning, everybody. Uh, Employer Right's been running for over 30 years. And so um, we, we've had a fantastic time over that period of time. And we have offices in Auckland and in Melbourne. And what we've been focusing on for many years, actually, is to stay current and relevant. And with uh, the coordination with SnapHire, we believe we're now able to deliver a very up-to-the-minute um, sort of um, uh, system for people to use. Now, we, we offer a full range of checks and an online system that allows for the client just to remove any of the pain or pressure points that might have been there in the past and make that experience for their applicant as um, rapid and uh, enjoyable as we possibly can. So um, we, we offer a full range of um, checks from reference checking, credit, criminal, drivers, ACC, verification of qualifications, you name it, um, professional memberships, uh, all sorts. So that is um, offered around New Zealand and also then we have global partners that we interact with overseas to deliver our checks you know, in the speediest uh, timeframes. And for the most part, you know, clients can um, order the, you know, the urgent level of checks, you know, through the Ministry of Justice as, you know, four working days, and we deliver those. So, uh, really, it is a, a pretty efficient system. And when I say that, it isn't just all about technology. There are breathing, living human beings on the other end of it, too, to respond to our clients' needs and to tweak and follow things up. So, yeah, uh, I guess the the whole thing with our company over that 30 year period, there wasn't too much in the way of technology 30 years ago, but by Joe's, over the last you know, six years, um, we've been refining so that it now is taking technology to you know, a very, very speedy um, experience for the candidate. They don't want to be sitting around 40 minutes um, printing and scanning and uploading. So we've been working now to um, uh, move to secured signing as well, which we're going to be releasing very shortly. So yeah, I, exciting times. Um, we we love what we do. We have a real passion for it, and we just love you know helping our clients um, make those really really appropriate hires. Awesome. And Katrina, what's the best way if people are interested in um, figuring out? A little bit more about whether this product's right for them. What's the best way for them to engage with you and and, and kind of get that journey started? Yes, certainly. Um, they can contact me on through my mobile on the website or email. And certainly, we create bundles and levels of checks. So, in any organisation, there might be three tiers, and then they have a standard um, level of checks, and then add to those um, potentially around roles. So, yeah, it can be created to be um, the right fit for them every time. And, yes, I would love, um, if they have an inquiry, to give me a call. I can come and see them or, you know, we can just discuss it over the phone if that's what they would prefer. 
Fantastic. And once a client makes a decision to move forward with employer right, often how long does it take to set them up and get them going? Oh, look, that's done within half a day, or, you know, or even less for that matter. We often have people ringing and saying, oh, it's urgent. And, you know, we, we can set things up. We just have an agreement for supply and capture their details and who will be operating, you know, who wants access to the system. And, you know, really to submit it, a candidate takes about 30 seconds. And so then um, we take over and work with the applicant and then the next thing they know, the results come in, which Daniela are probably going to tell us about shortly. Cool. Well, it feels like it's a good opportunity. It sounds like it's nice and simple to get going. It's not a big lengthy implementation process. So uh, maybe we could hand over to Daniela and she can kind of show us what it looks like now that it's all within that snap hire environment. Definitely. So um, if you can see my screen, this is what Employrate looks like from within the Talent App Store. Um, it gives you a quick blurb on Employrate, and then it also has some screenshots and some information here on the right hand side and also some prerequisites for this app. So this app works with the um, assessment hub within the Talent App Store within your ATS. Um, if ever you need um, help with setting up the assessment um, hub side of things, then you can just contact our client success team um, and we can help you do that. So from within um, Snapire, our ATS, um, Employrate appears in an assessment hub view. So in this workflow we have here, we have three candidates in this preempt check bucket and we can see that there's an employer right check here within this assessment hub tray. So this, um, for this candidate here, Ella Alton, this is what it looks like when a candidate hasn't had an employer right assessment started on them. So um, to show you what it looks like, we just click on this employer right check and we simply say start assessment. So this will send an email to the candidate asking them to log into Employer Right and complete the check. The check is whatever you have set up um, within your account with Employer Right. Um, so you'll be asked to do whatever checks you have set up there. So we'll click start assessment and you'll see it loads and the status on this check changes to in progress awaiting the applicant. So the applicant has sent an email with a, um, their username and password. The username is just their email address and a um, password is just a secure password that they are sent um, to use one off. They can't use it again once they've logged out of employee right. Now for this, um, my test candidate here, Sally Smith, um, the status of the icon is in progress, awaiting applicant. So they've been sent a username and password, which I have here. So I've clicked on the link in my email, I've pulled in, put in my username and password, and I'm just going to sign into Employ Right. Now this is what it looks like from a candidate's perspective when they've logged into Employ Right. They are, um, have an instruction with some instructions and the company that, they're, uh, that is asking for the checks to be complete. Then they're asked to um, submit some personal details and um, address details, ID, declarations, and then the application to complete. So it's really quick and easy for them to complete these checks and then they simply log out. Once they log out, um, so I'm not gonna go through all of the steps, but once they log out um, and they've completed their check, they can't log in again. And then once they've completed those forms, the status changes to forms complete. So if we click on this icon here, It'll say forms complete, and this is just letting us know that we're waiting for Employer Right to actually provide those um, the check results for this candidate. So, from a recruiter or manager's perspective, they just know that that candidate is waiting for that information to come through. When that information comes through, the icon on um, this candidate will change, and then they'll receive a report with those results, which um, Employer Right sends back through to your ATS. If you click into a candidate, you can also see, um, sorry, you can also see on the right hand side within this application for this job, the assessment hub tray with your employer right check there. So it is quick and easy to see from a candidate view or from your job list view and your bucket view where those um, checks, are, the status of those checks are sitting. Any questions so far? 
I don't, we've got none that have come through on in writing. So um, I think just keep trucking along and see how we get. Yeah. Um, I guess it is, yeah, important that Employrite is really quick and easy to use. Once you're, if you haven't installed the um, app, it'll just, um, you just go into the Talent App Store, install the app, and then it will say setup required here on the right hand side. This just means that Employrite needs to um, set up your account, which is really quick and easy. And then once that, once that happens, it'll change to this open sign. Um, if you click open, then, then it'll let you know what you need to set up within the assessment hub and what information Employrite needs um, from your ATS to be sent through. I guess that's all from me in terms of a demo. Um, is there anything else you'd like me to cover? Um, I don't know, Mel, do you have any thoughts in terms of other things that might be useful just while we're here? There, there are no questions coming through. So is there, is there anything else from your perspective? I think the key thing is it's super quick and easy really isn't it and all the information Absolutely. lives in one place yeah i guess the the key piece is just um there's a little bit of setup from from our side in terms of the ats you know linking up the assessment hub and um, once you do it once and um, you'll be able to do it all the time it's really really easy but you know as always contact myself or the client success team and we'll be able to kind of just talk you through those steps it does take just a few minutes to do and um, and then from employer right side and getting all that information just contact katrina and the team and they'll be able to provide that and this is a quick and easy implementation to set that up as well so do get in touch get a feel for kind of what they can provide your organization um, and then get in touch with us and we can go ahead and get the app installed and get you all set up and ready to go. Awesome and I guess the only other thing that I was just thinking there is if for any reason people can't see the install button um, or they can't take that action it just means that you probably haven't got the right permissions in Snapire so um, just making sure that you're you if you are interested that you're speaking to the right person within your team that has got those permissions. Um, Absolutely. Yeah. And uh, yeah, and but again, just reinforcing the team, um, the client success team are, are incredibly helpful and super friendly and they're um, accessible at hello at aatel.com. Correct. Cool. Is there any just last closing words from you, Katrina, in terms of the bit, you know, like just a little close out or things that you might want to have people take away? Certainly. Um... In terms of the online system, that's a, a, a work, always a work in progress. And so uh, when they think of process, you know, and that information, uh, candidate or the, the candidate completing the information, that populates into all the relevant forms. And then we'll have another release shortly around the digital signing whereby, you know, it only takes about 30 seconds. They don't even have to print or download anything, you know, with this further development. So um, it would be terrific to be able to show that because I know that clients are very much into the candidate experience and it not being onerous for them. So we, you know, we look to remove all those pain points for everybody and just deliver a really great service. Yeah, awesome. Well, it feels like it's a it's a nice quick one, ladies, but um, obviously encourage everyone to explore the opportunities that the um, Employer Right app offers to your team in terms of efficiencies and workflow and um, in terms of comparison for price points. We know that Employer Right stack up really well in terms of cost effectiveness with, with this kind of product in the market. So definitely make sure that you get in touch with Katrina and the team and start investigating how this might be able to work for you. Thanks for coming along today. I don't think it doesn't look like we've got any questions. So we will um, we'll wrap it up there and we'll get this video posted online um, for everyone else to, to check out. Thanks so much for coming, Katrina, and attending today, and Melissa and Daniela. Thanks, Lisa. Thank right. you. Have a good day. Bye. Bye.